Ryan, Ryan can start to worry about who's going to win the Kentucky Derby, old-fashioned midshipman or some new face that we've never heard of yet, which is probably the case. Do you have any horses? Right I don't have today, a. Go- I don't have any good three-year-olds. I wish I did. Uh, do I have any running today? No, I don't. I haven't even. Uh, I got one filly coming up that I got a name. Will be running in the next two weeks. I'll tell you when I name her. I haven't named her yet. That's the only new one I have. Uh, I don't have many uh, horses right now. I have the fewest I've had in a long, long time. I got a couple of little babies, but I don't have any racing horses right now. Most of them have uh, either retired or you know uh, gone, and that's it. I'm I'm kind of in between right now. I don't have a lot, as a matter of fact. I will have one horse racing in New York, a three-year-old filly. That's it right now. I don't have many racing age horses right now. I'm kind of in between. Uh, Keith joins us on the NFL now. What's up, Keith? Hey, Mike. How do you decide what to name a racehorse? Oh, uh, uh, you know, any, any whimsical thing. First of all, you can't name them, uh, anything suggestive or uh. anything obscene. You can't name, not that I would anyway, but you can't name them, uh, after so, uh, any famous person without their permission. Mm-hmm. Uh, a lot of times it's based on the names of the horses or just something, you know, you might name them after an expression or you might name them after something that is an inside Joke to some, you know, that's kind of interesting. You, on you your, keep us yeah. posted on yeah, your. Yeah, I mean, basically, you know, you name them after. I, I've gotten away from not to name them after people I know, or or because when you do that, then you don't want to ever get rid of them. So that that's a problem. So I've stopped doing that. I don't like to do that anymore because you want to be able to get rid of them if they're not doing well. So, but you know, whatever. I mean, you know, there are a million different ways of doing it. But it, it is some people that really take a lot of time, put a lot of time and effort into it. As a matter of fact. Kevin joins us on the NFL now. What's up, Kevin? Hey, Mike. How you doing this morning? How are you? Hey, Mike. I don't know if you remember. I'm a fireman that called you on 9-11 to tell you about my friend Teddy who died that day. Uh, yes, I remember that. All right. Well, you know, today's not really a sports day. Today's his birthday, so a couple of buddies and I, we're going to head over to the grave, you know, just visit, say hello. Well, that's very nice. Um, I, you there, Mike? Yeah, I'm, his, I'm listening. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, you know what I was going to say? Um, I went up to Saratoga over the summer. Right. And on...